all right everyone welcome back to this daily cryptocurrency video it is currently six and a six and a half six thirty in the morning right now my time um so the, those of you guys who are watching this good morning those of you guys who are in america good night and let's start off with this uh, video real quick bitcoin is currently down three and a half percent as we are speaking right now we took a massive massive hit and um i i have been predicting this for quite some time now ever since um you know we were right here i said that we might see a massive drop sorry it was right here um i said that we might continue down to uh 44k essentially so i said it i did say it at 56,000. and the reason why is that when we do have a massive drop and we consolidate it's usually followed by another massive drop and this is exactly what we are witnessing right now and another thing is that we did break the support right here at 55 56,000 level which was a pretty pretty big one right now i don't think you guys should panic sell i think this is a great opportunity to accumulate your bitcoins because if not the big institutions will have it okay that being said guys don't panic sell of course none of this is financial advice so that doesn't mean you know go buy and a uh, hundred thousand bitcoins on a hundred x leverage no that I, that's not what it means okay so um this would be on the on the four hour time frame let's take out the exponential moving average ema ribbon on the four hour time frame uh, as you guys can see right here, we have been rejected by the EMA ribbons. The bulls, they didn't allow us. They, they just didn't allow us. Uh, we, we attempted to break out a few times, guys, and we got rejected by the 20 EMA ribbon right here, the yellow line, uh, a few times, a couple times, and boom, we just came back. We crashed down, got rejected nice and nice and hard, and it is what it is. So let's have a look on the daily time frame and see what we can do over here on the longer short term on the macro on the macro side. So. On the daily time frame guys we've been supported by these exponential moving average since i believe october um yeah so since september we've been uh, you know we saw a bounce right here a bounce right here a bounce right here and a bounce right here and i told you guys that once we close below the exponential moving average it's going to be bad news beers for us and we are currently dumping right now so um the strongest support that we currently have right now is 43,000, 44,000 area and 46,000. in between this area there's going to be a lot a lot of support so guys, please don't short. You know, th this thing is already down. We saw a bunch of 30% uh, corrections. Like this, I believe is a, yeah, this is a 22% correction. If we see, if we see a 30% correction, it would bring us to the 44,000. Um, I believe we saw 30% correction over here. Uh, yeah, we saw 30% correction over here and we saw another 30% correction over here, I believe. 27, okay, so we got 30, 27, and now 24. Um, you see guys so we we corrected fairly a, a fair amount of time before going to 62,000 64,000 sorry this is 64,000 okay even 65,000 we corrected 30% three times approximately okay so you guys shouldn't panic like this is just another 30% correction if you bought the highs if you bought the peaks this is just um, this, this dip right here is just a, an opportunity essentially to average your cost down and average your your average price essentially from where you bought it so um so uh, i wouldn't panic sell it would be really really idiotic to just sell right now at 30 percent uh you know 25 percent decline so guys please don't do it let's have a look at ada cardano guys in my last video or in two videos ago uh where i said bitcoin's going to 44k and ada cardano 79 cents um as you guys can see we dropped all the way down to 89 cents guys which was the top of the support i predicted that it would come to the bottom of the support which is approximately 79 to 81 cents okay so um so that being said the last time we saw this candle right here it turned out pretty ugly and this is exactly what we're seeing right now we're seeing another rejection to the upside and the last time we saw a rejection to the upside what happened we saw another you know we saw another drop essentially so what can we see right here on cardano on the daily time frame can we see another consolidation before coming back down yes it's very possible and at the end it's all going to depend on the bitcoin Bitcoin. at the end of the day he is the king i tell you guys this in all my videos it's unfortunate that all these projects have good projects and and bitcoin just drags everyone you know he just drags everyone with them it's unfortunate but how, that's how it is and there's nothing much you can do about it let's have a look at um okay I iota is a great project it's you know it's sitting at a heavy heavy support right now in my opinion and they're coming out with their firefly wallet so in my opinion this would be a good opportunity to buy and um yeah that would be my just my opinion of course let's have a look at other coins we got matic we got link okay so let's have a look at link and take out the vpvr real quick on link um visible range Okay, so link right here. We are currently. I, I believe it could come down to 27 since we uh, if we do break the support right here at 32. 
So we could come back down to 27. It's going to be very interesting to see what Link does. Uh, we tried to break out a few more times, a couple times actually, on the four hour time frame and failed to do so. And failed to do so. I believe we are seeing, no, I wouldn't call this an M pattern. But um, yeah, but we saw a few, a few rejections to the top, I would say. We saw one, two, three, four rejections to the breakout. We can break, we couldn't break above 45. And we are also making lower highs right here, as you guys can see. This is lower highs, so we are in a downtrend on link, unfortunately. Um, even though, even if we come back down up to 38, sorry, we could still get rejected and come back down. So it's going to be very interesting to see how things uh, settle in the next couple of uh, hours, few, you know, month, not months, uh, hours, days, upcoming weeks. Um, in my opinion, we are still going to have an alt season and. And this is how it's gonna play out in my opinion so I think we're gonna drop down to 45k approximately 45k and once we drop to 45k we're probably gonna consolidate and when we consolidate that's when we're gonna have the alt season essentially so um, so yeah I don't think you guys should panic I mean like Bitcoin and the you know at the on the macro time side sorry guys I'm so tired on the macro side it ends up recovering so I, I really really don't think you guys should uh you know end up panicking right now this is CAG currently down oh my god CAG just took a you know massive hit I believe we did a double top right here and we are on the verge of breaking the neckline if that does happen I believe we could come back to uh you know the 12 cent area area if not 28 at least or well we did peak down here to uh 28 but we do have um some support right here still as you guys can see between the 28 region and 23 region we have some support so if you guys are holding cag unfortunately i would not panic sell when it's down uh, i don't even know 60 percent yeah i i would not do that guys so um you know regarding cag it's a great project they just got uh you know barcelona into their uh into their side so um that being said guys don't don't start panic selling at 60 percent off if you bought the dips we also saw an inverse uh, sorry a regular head and shoulders on chg right here as you guys can see this was the head and shoulder right here and if i take the target for chg and i take it at their breakout that's essentially you know that's essentially 18 cents and it's almost at the you know the, the recent support right here that i just mentioned a few seconds ago which is a 23 cent so um so yeah that being said even though we could still drop it would be a good opportunity to accumulate cag chilies they're a great project and i think they have a bright future it's just unfortunately bitcoin is dumping right now which you know everything it will just drag everything with it anyways guys this is the daily cryptocurrency video if you guys like this video please like comment subscribe and i'll see you guys tomorrow